guys welcome back to my channel I hope you've all had a great week so I'm just going to be dip dyeing my irresistible me extensions today I have the new Schwarzkopf live color pastels and these are so awesome they're semi permanent by the way they're not fully permanent and they come out with eight washes so I decided that I wanted baby blue because I love blue and I think it'll match my eyes and everything so these launch in New Zealand on the 7th of September which is so exciting you can buy them from anywhere you can buy hair dye so like chemists and supermarkets and farmers so they've also got other colors coming out as well as the baby blue they've also got the lavender lolly and the cotton candy pink which looks so cool here's a small photo of how they look like so it is spring now here in New Zealand so I think dip dyeing your hair is a perfect trend to have in spring because it's just going to add a pop of color to your hair and it's going to look really nice and bright for spring and summer when you dip dye your hair you obviously want to have blonde hair so if you have dark hair just like bleach it at the ends and then you can dye it and if you have blonde hair you're good to go but if you have blonde hair you want to make sure that you have no yellow tones or orange tones or anything in your hair and you want to make it as toned and as like light blonde as possible so you won't get a green effect so if you want to dip dye the Schwarzkopf color in your own hair all you have to do is split your hair into two sections make sure you're wearing old clothes you want to flip the other piece to the back and then you have your hair and then you just tease this up with a teasing comb like I'll pretend I'm teasing it you tease it up whatever and then you just dye the tip so that's going to help you get that faded effect and you need damp hair by the way when you put in these colors it says shampoo and towel dry hair apply color and leave on for 2 to 15 minutes rinse thoroughly and style as usual we recommend using two packs or more if your hair is longer with chin length so now i'm going to show you how to dip dye your hair extensions so first you will need a bowl the schwarzkopf live color pastels a brush a teasing comb some tin foil and obviously your extensions so you'll need about a piece of tin foil this big so you can fly all the extensions across it and you just want to take your brush and smooth it down nice and flat so it is going to be easy to put in the color now you want to open up your box what you get is a pre-made sachet which is so handy some instructions and some gloves and I'm going to put these on so I don't get my hands stained now I'm going to cut the sachet open and I'm going to pour it in and this reminds me of purple shampoo but in a way thicker version and it actually smelled really nice as well. So that's how much you get from one sachet and then I'm going to use number two and pour that in as well. So now I'm using the Schwarzkopf Ultimate Color Conditioner and adding this in. This will just add more product and make it go a longer way and make the color a bit lighter to start off with so it's not so dark. Now I'm just using an old teasing comb and I'm just brushing it through all down the ends and I'm putting it up to a length where I would like the ombre to start. Now I'm just using little motions at the top and kind of doing little brush strokes just to make it fade in. I don't want the colour to just cut off so this will help it to fade in a lot. Now I'm just turning the extensions over and I'm repeating the process on the other side. So I'm just using that brush and smoothing it all out again and then I'm using my teasing comb and you just want to make sure to do little brush strokes at the top because we don't want any harsh lines and we want it to fade in really nicely. Now you just want to rinse off the colour, I'm just using my thumb and squeezing it in between my hands and I'm just making sure there's no product left on the extensions and then after that you want to blow dry them nice and dry okay guys there we go so that was my first time dip dyeing my hair and it was actually way easier than I thought okay so I just went ahead and put in my extensions and straighten them so this is how they look like so as you can see they look so nice it fades in it doesn't really chop off it just fades in really nicely and the color is so super cool as well i like the length where i put it as well so my hair's a bit frizzy at the moment just my natural hair so i'm going to take the schwarzkopf ultimate stylist satin frizz control straightening spray so this is great because it gets rid of all the frizz and all the flyaways and it makes it nice and smooth and straight 
I'm just going to spray a bit of this in and then smooth my hair down. Okay guys, there we go. I went ahead and curled my hair. I think the dip dye looks so awesome with curled hair as well. So that's how it looks like with curled hair. I don't know what I like it better with, curled hair or straightened hair, but I think they both look pretty cool. Okay, so now I'm going to use the Schwarzkopf Stylist Ultimate Amino Q Hold Hair Spray, and this is an ultra strong hold. So this will be great for keeping curls in place. This will help your curls last all day. It'll make your hair look even better when you're out and about. Then for the ultimate beachy look, I want mine to look really beachy and nice. So I'm going to be using the Schwarzkopf Stylist Ultimate Sea Salt Beach Look Texture Spray with Sea Salt. And it says for tousled beach styles. So I think I'm going to get a lot of use out of this one. Yum, this smells really good as well, this spray. So these Schwarzkopf Live Pastel colours were so nice and conditioning and smoothing and they didn't make my hair feel all dry and dead. But if your hair does go a bit dry, you can use the Schwarzkopf Hair Repair Liquid Keratin Ultimate Repair Anti-Damage Mask. So this is for very damaged and dry hair. I used to use this all the time. It smells so good. It just looks like that. It's big thick cream. I just love the smell. And to prolong the colour of your hair dye, what you can do is you could use the Schwarzkopf Ultimate Colour Conditioner. And this is for coloured and highlighted hair. And you can also pair that with the Schwarzkopf Hair Repair Colour Protect Shampoo. And this is also for coloured highlighted hair. I definitely recommend you guys go and check out this pastels from Schwarzkopf. I love it so much. So let me know down below in the comments if you've dip dyed your hair before or what you think of it or if you're willing to try it. And I'll see you guys in my next week's video. Bye!